YouTube team keep it clean what's going on it's engraven here with another video and in this video uh, we just came from watching John Harbaugh's part of his presser from today uh, that featured both him and Tavon Young uh, and if anybody else was on my apologies I didn't see it yet uh, but anyway from John Harbaugh's part of the presser uh, he spoke about Nick Boyle Said Nick Boyle, he's coming along, he should be practicing soon. Didn't give a definitive timetable, but again, we know John Harbaugh, when it comes to definitive timetables with injuries, he says no more. Uh, he said, obviously, Ronnie Stanley is out uh, for the game this upcoming Sunday, uh, but he also said that Sammy Watkins is out as well. Uh, so there had been some, he, he hadn't been practicing, so we were, of course, concerned that he may be out, uh, but now it has become official that he will not play in the game against the Chargers. And that is a huge blow uh, to the Ravens team. Not one that they can't overcome, but it is a huge blow uh, going into a very, 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 very tough game uh, this upcoming Sunday. But help is on the way because he did say it hasn't. Now, even though he said it, this is why I can't get too excited yet. He had he did say that he expects first round wide receiver. Rashad Bateman to play in the game this Sunday against the Chargers. He said he expects him to play. And we, of course, remember the report that came out last week where it said that Rashad Bateman, that they thought that he might play last week, but they were like, no, 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 no. Sway to the Chargers. And one thing about Rashad Bateman with him coming into the lineup for the Ravens is that something that we talked about a lot is that there, there was no pressure on him. There was no pressure on Rashad Bateman. It's like, hey, the passing game is going good without you. But we know it could be even better with him. And he would be a nice, healthy addition to the lineup. But now with Sammy Watkins being out, we always talk about how timing is everything. And it's just it's so crazy how that timing worked out, isn't it? It's very, very crazy. Sammy Watkins, it's, it's a game last week against the Colts, Monday Night Football. It's like, oh, can Rashad Bateman play? Oh, it's looking like he's going to play. Then at the last say, oh, no, 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 Rashad Bateman, he's not playing. He's not going to play this week. And then in that game, Sammy Watkins ends up getting hurt. Ends up getting hurt. And then the same injury that he got knocked out of the game from, it makes him miss the following week. But that's when Rashad Bateman is up. So will he essentially be Sammy Watkins' replacement? Definitely not right away. It's going to take time. And again, if he does play in the game against the Chargers, please do not put all these crazy expectations on him. Don't do that. Because you're going to end up driving yourself crazy you're gonna end up getting your feelings hurt and then you're gonna end up being like oh man this guy he ain't even that good if you put these crazy expectations on him especially with how everything is going right now without him but if you come and put all these crazy expectations on Rashad Bateman especially from jump eventually hey do all the expectations you want but from jump I would have advised against it just so you don't drive yourself crazy and, and then you don't end up forming these crazy theories and whatnot based off of something that just doesn't even make sense. It's going to take time for him to get adjusted. It's going to take time for him to get acclimated. It's going to take time for him to get comfortable with the Ravens' offense. Now, well, it would be lovely if he came in and boom, 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 boom. He was ready to go. Everything was just smooth from jump. That'd be great. Him and Lamar, they got chemistry. They going, they clicking and whatnot. That'd be a beautiful thing. And you never know, hey, it could be one of them Odell Beckham Jr. things where he plays and then he ends up going crazy. That would be great, but I just don't expect it. So, but with him expected to, uh, to play, it's a good sign. I was just talking to my guy JT a couple of minutes ago. And he was, thinking, he was just saying like, man, why did, they, why did they rush Ronnie Stanley back? Why did they rush him back? And I told him, well, even just based off of this season alone, they certainly learned that lesson with rushing people back. That's why they've been taking their sweet time with Rashad Bateman. They've been, they've been like, oh, even like, again, last week, he was expected to play, but they're like, oh, you know what? No, 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 they just give him a little more time. A little more time. Then he come back next week. So they learned their lessons. They learned some lessons this year the hard way. Um, and they, they've also had a lot of unfortunate circumstances uh, happen as well. Uh, so shout out to Bateman. We're going to see. How it is, again, it has to be made official first. And, and I, since Harbaugh said this today, uh, we should expect that it is made official uh, within the next probably 24 hours, really. 
for the next 24 hours. Certainly, the, the deadline will be Saturday by 4 p.m. So, li- wor- not even worst case scenario, but late late case scenario, it ends up happening tomorrow. But with Harbaugh putting it out there, because you you know you know Ravens they like to be sneaky with stuff. They don't like to really be straightforward with stuff because they like to play the, the the chess games, the mind games, and all that. They like to do all that. But with Harbaugh actually acknowledging it publicly, like saying it, oh, yeah, we expect Rashad Bateman to play, then they ain't got to beat around the bush with activating him to the roster. They ain't got to do all that funny stuff. They ain't got to wait till the last second to act. No, you could just go ahead and get it over with now since Harbaugh has let us know that it's coming. So when that time comes, when it becomes official official, you already know. Uh, But until then, hey, it's just talking for now. So anyway, like Rashad Bateman isn't expected to be any longer at, well, when it comes to this Chargers game, I'm out. Love y'all team. Keep it clean. See y'all soon.